Hey guys, Prince of Mastodon here. We're gonna do some spark chess tonight. And uh, as usual, I'll let people invite me to play. And then we shall play whoever invites me. And it usually doesn't take too long to get a game going. Like I just logged in and you'll see how fast it takes for someone to invite me. Cause you know, people just wanna play and they don't really discriminate. So they just invite whoever. So it's pretty sweet. Why am I still waiting, huh? Nah. Um, what's going on? Oh, in Texas, man, that is some really sad stuff. What's happened to uh, to Texas, like especially around the Houston area? Man, they got slammed so bad by the hurricane, and it, it's like out of control flooding. And uh, I had experience with flooding. Uh, I, I used to live in uh, Louisiana back in the day, and I remember like my whole neighborhood just went underwater. It was. I wouldn't say it was fun, but it was definitely an adventure. Like you take a little, uh, you know, pontoon boat, you have to row out, and then by the time the flood subsides, uh, you're, you know, you go back to your place, and then you see that everything's damaged from the water. Water damage is very, very, very bad. All right. Oh, <laughs> thanks, ranked IGM. All right. Well, let someone else invite me then. Um. But yeah, yeah, definitely uh, my heart goes out to those affected by this hurricane. Pretty sad stuff. Here we go. Sorry that it took so long. But yeah, usually it goes by really fast, you know, waiting. Packer B is his name. And he's got pretty much, well, a very similar uh, avatar as myself. Why do people like opening with their queen, like on their second move? I don't understand that. That was a mistake. Watch, when I eat this, now I've got his queen and bishop here under under fire. Oh no, my bad. Sorry, I wasn't thinking. But you know what? I can totally push that queen out of the way. With this! Now, now I'm trying to think what's my best option here. Okay, let's get this knight going here. Actually, he can eat that. No, he can't. Because my knight's protecting it. Let's get this person out. My knight. And if he eats my queen, my knight can protect. I won't have to ruin my ability to castle if he does that. I would say I have the superior opening right now. Just on virtue of me having moved three pieces, he's only moved two pieces. And one of those pieces is a no-no to move at the beginning. The queen. But, you know, this is all just theory. You saw me get my butt kicked by that one guy who was moving his, you know, his A-pawn at the opening. So, you know, it, it does happen. Where, you know, you can violate the opening principles if you're a really damn good uh, middle game player. So what is he planning to do with that? He's going to eat my knight. Okay. Okay. I can prevent that. Only I can prevent early checkmates and early cheap shots. Nah, let's just remove this bishop. So now he's only moved one piece in the op in the opening. This is queen, basically.
Uh, I had to make a defensive move here. Got to move my bishop back here. I didn't want to do that, but I didn't want to put my, my bishop in danger by having that queen next to him. But hey, you know, I'm good because he's only moved his queen, basically. So I, I still have a superior development right now. I, I do want to put some pressure up here, though. So at my earliest convenience, I do want a castle. So having that queen, you know, it is a nuisance, but if you can block the nuisance, then he's his development is extremely retarded. And that's not used in the derogatory sense. Retarded just means to slow, you know, the progress of something. You know, to... Oh, never mind. All right, so he's got his bishop out here. Okay. Screw it. Let's just eat it. Eat it, Joes. So now he's back to only moving his queen again. I don't think that's the best way he wants to open this. So I'm going to castle. Now, what I want to do is get my knight up here. I can cause some pretty good mayhem, but he blocked it with that knight move just now, so never mind. I, mean, I could do this. Let's do that. That way he can't castle yet. He's got a he can't ignore this threat on on this side with my knight. He's going to move back. Could swallow this. Once I eat that, and then my my knight's stuck here. It's a risk. That is totally a risk. You know what? I'm gonna risk it. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna risk it for for a lowly pawn. Yeah, I am. Let's risk it. So I could potentially be throwing my knight away. Most likely I'm throwing my knight away right now. He's going to block it like that. Yep, <laughs> he got me there. Damn, why did I do that? Oh well. Can't say that I'm too sad by that. Man, look at me losing my knight for no reason. Jeez Louise. See, I am now peace behind, guys. And I was even talking about that being a, a bad idea. But you know... Um, I think it makes it more exciting when you take risks like that. But I should have saw that immediate threat of him just moving his pawn up. Now, that was an oversight by me.
But that's why I play chess. You know, it, it gets my my mind in the right frame of mind. Because right now it's not quite in the right frame of mind at the moment. I'm hoping I could somehow snatch one of his pieces away and make this even again. See, the the prudent thing of me, the prudent thing I should have done was just keep doing what, what I was doing. You know, making small, superior moves, positionally speaking. That would have been the easiest course to victory. But here, I was, I was trying to take a shortcut to victory. And I, it made me miss the most obvious threat to my to my knight. And that's chess, you know? You, that's what happens when you stop thinking. If you stop thinking, you make stupid moves like that. Stupid, stupid, stupid moves like that. Well, at least I can go a pawn up here. do that why did you do that I think I might have caught up just now I'll just eat this and now his queen's in danger I don't know why he did that now he loses his queen and I win <laughs> yeah! So, I got it back. Whew. So, let's see if he invites you back for another game. He might want to He might want to rematch. And I will give it to him. What was his name again? Packer B? I'll let him invite me. He has left. Well, let's see who else is going to... Oh, here he is, Packer B. Let's give him a rematch here. Okay. We're going to Sicilianate this guy. Ooh, he is taking shortcuts right here with his opening. I like it so much. He might just push his pawn down. He did not. He's he's going for the early checkmate. But why would you do something like that when you know I can block it? Man, he, he must be pissed off. Do you see how fast he's moving right now? I mean, good lord. Wow, see that? He's like, just gunning it right now. He thinks he's, he can beat me by just going fast. It's not working though. It better not work, I'd be really upset. Let's go ahead and get this knight going here. But he's made a mistake of only moving one piece right now, again. So he wants to take this this little pawn right here. I could just move this like this and protect it. So he's playing an irrational game of chess right now, and I think I'm going to spank him for it. Because you see what happened to me when I made that one irrational move? It almost costed me. Let's go ahead and castle. Because you know he's going to castle. Maybe not. He should have. Because now I'm going to... No, I can't do that yet. Let's go in castle.
I mean, psychologically speaking, I have more I want him because he just lost a match. He's a little bit rattled right now. He's making some pretty irrational decisions. As far as I know. <laughs> If I can bring his bishop down right here, but it won't accomplish anything. Oh, that might accomplish him. So he just threw away his, his queen just now. See that? I will eat it. <laughs> Game's over. He's gonna quit now. I told you. See, I, I'm, I'm gonna give him a third chance to beat me. Let's decline this guy. I want to play that one guy again. What's his name again? I keep forgetting what his name was. I'll note when I see it. He might be uh, raging in his room right now. Going, why? Why did I do stuff like that? Why? Why did I do stuff? I don't think he's coming back. He's not going to cool off and re-examine his uh, approach. Because, you know, he had me in that first match, but he just... I don't know what happened to him. Second match, he, he had no, no hope in that second match. All right, well... Uh, I don't think he's coming back. And no one's inviting me. Not anymore. I should have said yes to that one guy who offered me a match. But I was hoping to make it three matches against the same guy. Ah, you guys are probably getting bored of this, so I'm going to stop.